<laughs> I'm actually like, doesn't work in Dark Siders. I was trying to get it like to like. Here like, we go. Okay. See, I I also recognize the Sonic, but the most I've experienced this game was like the classic Sonic demo that you can play at like Target. That was cool. Like, except it was really rough, is my understanding. Yeah, it just it like the like, physics. It wasn't a finished version. But yeah, well, I mean, and there's. See, look. There's look, two demos. Like, look how he's like. Yeah, because there was there was a there was the modern Sonic demo. I thought there was two classic ones. I might be. No, there was a modern Sonic one and there was a classic one. Fuck. See, that's annoying looking. That was because I was supposed to dash there, and, and I was supposed to use this awesome blue burst thing. Whoa! Whoa! Woo! You are certainly going fast. And then I hit. No my... one can claim you are not. I actually wondered, like, is there a system to, like, figure out exactly how fast Sonic is going? Oh, to there end? totally has to be. Like, but, like, in the game system, like, did they think about, like, the physics, like, that was required? There like, has the... to be on, like, some kind of fundamental level. Just in order to, like, so I'm realizing make some of this stuff work. I'm realizing how much I'm missing, like, some of the... Because we got rid of some of the, um, the, 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 the graphics for, like, Whoa. the control thing. Yeah, that was, a. Uh, like, and I realized that, like, some of it's Whoa! a part of the, uh, it's a part of the interface. Like, it makes it cool. So, like, like, so I can know that I'm done with the little trick thing here? Uh, that's... Yeah, like, it's a part of the interface. It's not just the thing. It's not just there to tell me things I already know about this game. <laughs> if you get hit, you drop your rings! <laughs> Sonic 101! Uh -huh. Sonic 101! Sonic 101, this will be a, there will be a test on this. You know, if you hold the joystick forward, you, know, Sonic you go fast! You know what this game is missing? This game is missing because Sonic says after every level. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not related to the game at all. Like, if someone's trying to steal something from you, you should stop them and call an adult or something. Call an adult. Call an adult. I'm 20 years old and I'm telling you to call an adult. Fuck you. I'm Jeremy, let's be honest. What? Neither of us are adults. I'm 20 years old. I'm as old as Sonic. Well, actually, no. Sonic's a couple Sonic's years. Sonic's 20. No, he's not 25. I'm 25 at this point. No, he's 20. Okay. Or 20. Well, actually, this game came out. Like, is Sonic old enough to drink? Now he is. That's concerning. <laughs> If Sonic runs really fast and gets drunk and he, like, gets pulled over... Well, for one thing, you have to be able to pull over Sonic the fucking Yeah, Hedgehog. your, your, your logic is immediately falling apart. <laughs> but, like, is it considered it, a DUI? They just see him go by and they're like... Mm -mm. <laughs> if he's in his cart, though, it is. <laughs> Sonic All-Stars. Sonic All-Stars. Danica Patrick gets drunk Look. gets arrested for drunk driving. Yeah. No! Sonic Styles on Okay, I'm gonna try to go to the options and get some back, get back some of my, uh, some of my interface stuff because that's cool looking. Hold on, hold on. Tails has to come back from the abyss. Hey, Sonic, what's going on? Rob got you. Watch everything. Why? I don't understand. It's, it's, it's arms. The 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 fox. The magic. He's a magical kitsune. I think you should have played this with the real hedgehog mod. <laughs> I think. I think after all is said and done, I might just do that. Also, no, this actually has a lot of cutscenes. It's not like as cutscene heavy as Sonic 06. It's also not as loading time heavy. Yeah, actually, because they're masking. Well, no, there is loading screens on this, but at the same time. It's not 45 second long loading screens. Or two minute long loading screens. And it's not between every single piece of dialogue. Man, I remember Midnight Club on the PSP. Yeah? What about it? The loading times were so bad on that. You could actually, uh, you could cheat the system and play, um, and you could play multiple people off of the same disc. Yeah. So, like, you'd start up a match, and it would load that entire, like, city into your, uh, into your memory. That's why it took so long to load. Because, like, there wasn't any set courses. It was, like, burnout, where you could go however you wanted to do, go to get somewhere. Yeah. So they had to load the entire city. So you'd wait until it was about done loading, and it loaded the city, and you'd pop the UMB tray open. And to your friend, they load it up, join your match, like, you have to start off with a host. And you could do that, like, as many times as the game would allow. Okay, so one thing I have to say about this is I just noticed Tails was doing something with his tail. He was, like, like grooming himself. 
mean, that just... I mean, they're still animals on a fundamental level. Except he's one that... Except he's a... Now what's this? This is an information pod. This handy bus will be information about the game. Feel free to talk to if you need a refresher. Glad I asked. Axe. Oh, there's Axe. You, yeah, it's like classic Sonic and... Yeah, Act 1 tends to be easier. Okay, I just want to get back to... I want to go to, like, options. Is there, like... Do I have to go... Yeah, we're gonna, yeah. Did you save? It, it, it auto saves. Ah. See, that always freaks me out in auto save games when it pops up and says, like, "Any save progress may be lost," and I'm like, but I can't save it. Okay, you're yeah, just gonna continue from where we left off. There he goes. Yeah. Oh my God. I like how. <coughs> I just like how there's, like how the how he looks like, like the detail put into his gloves. Yeah, it's. Like this game, and there's nothing up here. If yet, there's cause... nothing, if there's nothing else about this game. It's, it's pretty gorgeous. Oh yeah, and this is this is this, yeah, this is lowest settings on an obvious console port. Cause like you go into the settings and it's like, hey, you can turn the reflections down, <laughs> the shadows. You down. turn the shadows down, and that's, that's it. it. Yeah. There you go. So I'm gonna uh, switch to you, like uh, you might not need V-Sync. Uh, it's just like the problem is I don't like going around this like why this like empty world. As, See, I as, like this if it were more full, and I have to imagine it gets more full. It's well, like you'll get you'll get like little challenges things up here, and there's more levels. See, I but this I is think, it. This is it. This is the overworld. There is this is it, and each time you're blocked off by the the, the boss guy geese, and you gotta you gotta beat all three, and you gotta like yeah. So there's your motivation, basically. Yeah, you can't confit. Yeah. Look, oh, there's also like a Chaos Emerald that you oh. get from beating bosses. We talked about Crash Bandicoot <coughs> earlier, and that totally looked like the... Oh, you mean the crystal, the, 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 what were those things? Because there were crystals which were like long and like then, then you had like the anti-crystals, which were the gems. You had the they, gems as well, and those were bonus things, weren't they? <coughs> well, that was how you got your true ending. That's in, right. In Crash Bandicoot 2, you could get, you could, you found all the crystals which were purple. Except in Crash Bandicoot 1, they were, like, different colors. Yeah. Oh, there's skills in... Oh, I didn't get any skills. Shit. See, skills in this kind of game... I'm immediately having, like, terrifying flashbacks to Sonic and the Secret Rings. Oh, my God. Because I rented that. Oh, okay. I See, I've never... Okay, I will say this. And <laughs> Sonic and the Secret Rings is fun once the game decides you're allowed to have fun with it. Like, once you unlock... All of the things that make Sonic be Sonic. Yeah. Which, once again, I'm clearly pro game designer, as we've surmised. Yeah. And I feel like you shouldn't be locking off. Uh, just like things like that, just like like basic Sonic basic things. aspects of a character. Like Sonic should always system. be able to do this. The, do this. He should so, like, always be able to do that. How's the unlockable system looking in this? Um. What? Like, what do you mean? Like. Or have does does it at any point feel like they've gimped your no, gameplay? No, like every character does everything that they need to do. And in fact, like when it introduces a new like game design thing, like a thing that so that Sonic should always be able to do, it's just a part of the game. The, the game, like it's just a part of it. It's so then, what does the upgrade system really? It it just makes like I think it just makes things. It's just a, like a little boat. Like one's like, oh, if you do this one, modern Sonic will move a little bit faster. If you do this one, classic Sonic will be able to stop on a dime. And I'm like, that's cool. But like, it's Sonic and the Secret Rings. Ah! What are levels? Why? We were having the discussion about this earlier. Except this is a water level that I think works. See, it's not a lot of water level. Yeah, because you have this great kind of like backdrop of the... But I'm immediately against the water level where you have to like... Breathe. Well, guess what? Yeah. I, I am to, aware. I was about to die. But, uh, but yeah, Sonic and the Secret Rings, like, when you first started playing it, Sonic, like, I don't, I might be wrong, but I don't think you could do, like, the spin move. That's not good. No, you should never have a Sonic game where Sonic Like, can't. you steered like a tank. It was impossible to do certain side missions. I remember that. Like, you move slower. Get this red thing. Like, it just there fundamentally you gimped you as a character. Wasn't it like, you guys, like, what's this, what's this, like, I'll be honest, I never played that one. Mainly because it didn't have a Wii. 
And also because it's... Like, I haven't played much of Modern Sonic. Like, my, my Sonic memories... Like, most Modern Sonic I ever played was Sonic Adventure 2. And that was... That was it. Jeremy. Hmm? Will you admit on recording... What? Right now. Okay, depending on what, it, what is it? Sonic Adventure is a bad game. <laughs> I don't want You can love something and you can enjoy the fuck out of it and it can be amazing to you. It can still be bad. 